Hi guys! Today it is Monday, September 10th, which means I am back from my birthday week and I had a lot of fun. Um, I did have to work all this week. Yeah, so I mean it was a lot of fun. I love my job, so it was a lot of fun and I got paid for it, which is even better. So I did all that and then I celebrated my birthday this past weekend and I missed you guys a lot. Like, I was like, oh, I can go on my YouTube and I loved interacting with you guys and talking with you guys. Um, so I really did miss that this week. But I got some fresh new ideas on videos, um, what types of videos I'd want to make. And it was, I guess it was good because I was kind of in a rut of what types of videos to make. So now I have some awesome ideas. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to stop rambling and get into my birthday haul. I don't have a lot. I just have a couple of things that I want to share with you. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. The first thing that I have here, I'm hoping that you guys can see. Um, if you know me, you would know that I have a black pug named Dominic. And we, my husband and I also have a Doxy Poo mix which is a Dachshund Poodle Mix. We're not sure, but we think that's what she is. She's from the, um, we got it from the SPCA, um, or ASPCA, excuse me. So I love dogs. So I got this card from my mother-in-law, father-in-law, and sister-in-law, and it is absolutely adorable. I hope you guys can see it. And it is actually from Tay Tay, <laughs> Taylor Swift, right here. And it has a black pug and a white pug here. And they both have like little headbands on that say happy birthday on it. And then it says, life is just funnier with you around. And I absolutely love this card because I love pugs and dogs in general. But I really love pugs. And I just thought this card was so cute. And it's actually funny because my sister-in-law, she has a bug, which is a Boston Terrier pug mix and I got her this card for her birthday and I just I loved it it was so cute but I was I'm not gonna buy myself a birthday card um so it was so funny that they got me this card for my birthday too so I'll bring it in a little bit more hopefully you guys can see it but I just love this card so much so yes I I just love it. And I also got a couple of other cards. I got some one from my husband and my other family members, which mean a lot to me too. But I just thought I would share that one with you because it's really cute. Um, the next thing that I got, or didn't get yet, I'm going to get, um, is an iPhone 4GS. And I don't have it with me yet because I haven't bought it yet. Um, but I'm going to wait till the iPhone 5 comes out. And plus my... My uh, upgrade doesn't isn't valid till the end of the, this month, so I don't know what's going on with the iPhone 5 when it's coming out or whatever. Um, but at the end of this month, I'm going to hopefully be getting my iPhone 4GS, and I'm so excited. I've wanted an iPhone since they first came out, and right now I just have this Pantech phone. It's pink, which pink is my favorite color, and it's got touch screen here, and then. It just has the keys and, you know, this. I don't know what the name of this is. Um, but, yes, it's time for an upgrade. So I cannot wait to get my iPhone. I'm going to get Instagram, which I'm so excited about. I'm always jealous of some people Instagram. Um, so I've been debating on getting the black one or the white one. Um, it's just like I don't know which one to get. I really am aiming towards the white one. So, leave me a comment down below telling me if you have the iPhone, which color you got, or if you could get one, what color you would get. So, yeah, I'm leaning more towards the white, but, yeah, just let me know in the down bar. Or, excuse me, in the comments, let me know um, which color you would get or have. Um, so, I'm really, really excited about that. And then, I have a couple of nail polishes. Like, I don't even need them. I have so many. But um, they had this deal at um, a local salon that uh, is around my area. And they were buy one, get two free. And actually, I'm missing two of them. Did I bring them in with me? No. I didn't bring them in with me. I will put them in another haul. But I got um, the OPI... 
did you hear about Van Gogh? It was, it's really pretty. It's like a, a muddy, like, neutral color. And then I got, um, Amsterdam from, I think it's the Holland Collection? I think so. It's really pretty. It's like a maroon color with a hint of glitter in it. So they're buy two get one free, or buy one get two free, which is crazy. So the other thing I got, I actually got one of these for my sister-in-law too because she loves Spider-Man. She loved the new movie. And I got this for myself also. And it comes with four of the mini OPI nail polishes, which I thought, you know, would be good for me because I have so many nail polishes. But I really wanted to try, especially Spotted the Lizard. Um, and I just love the packaging. I unfortunately did not get to go see the movie, but when it comes out on Blu-ray, I'm definitely going to rent it and take them out here. And I mean, these are, they're so little. I love, I love, I love, love, love many things. Um, so I thought this would be good to, you know, just to try them out. And if I really, really, really love it, then I will go purchase the full size. I mean, it's just, I have so many nail polishes. So this one here is called Into the Night, and I'm hoping you guys can see this. Um, I don't have, like, an autofocus camera, so I apologize. But this is, like, a navy blue color, which I have been on the hunt for. But it's, like, a metallic navy blue color with just a hint of, like, microfiber silver glitter. And I just love, love this one. The next one I got is called Number One Nemesis. And first of all, I want to say this also. The only thing I don't like about these minis is that on the bottom, it doesn't say the name of it. So I have to read it off the box here. Um, so that's the only negative I have about these. But um, again, this is Number One Nemesis. And this is like a gold shimmer, gold and silver shimmer with like a black base I would say it's really pretty I love this one too so there's that the next one is my favorite I cannot wait to wear this one it's like so unique and beautiful and this is just spotted the lizard and it's like a gold color with, um, it's ir not iridescent, how would I, like duochrome. A duochrome of blue and green. And this is gorgeous. And I think I heard that this is like a dupe for Chanel's Peridot. It's, it's stunning. It even has little flecks of glitter in it. I think it's gold glitter. This is like absolutely stunning. And it's funny, I, um, and if, in a, future haul, if I could talk, in future haul, I actually bought the, um, this similar color like this in the Maybelline Fall collection in the nail polishes. I think it's called Boho Gold, and it's just exactly like this. So, if you can't find, like, a mini nail polish of this, and if you don't want to spend $8.50 for it, I would um, recommend the Maybelline Boho Gold. And the last one I have here is Your Web or Mine. And this is like a like a salmony pink color frosted with some uh, silver flecks in it. And this is gorgeous too. Oh, I just love them. So there's the first set I got. And then got two more. The next whoops! It's falling all over the place. <laughs> the next thing I got is the Dutch treats. Um, and this is from the Holland Collection, I believe. Yes, the Holland Collection, Spring Summer 2012. Or, I think it was Spring. The Spring one. And I just love this packaging here. And again, this has four colors. Like the other one. And I'm going to open this up so I can give you a closer view of them. Okay. So, the first one I have, I actually have on my nails today. And... I saw this in the bigger bottle, and I decided I would, again, get in the smaller one because I have so many, but I think I might have to get this in a big bottle once I run out of this. And it's called I Have a Herring Problem, and I have it on my nails as well, and it's just like a, in the bottle it looks more like a dusty gray blue with 
like go micro gold glitter but when you see it on the nails here it's more like a bluish gray and I think this is perfect for fall I love this color so I highly recommend that one if you're on the lookout for a new fall color the next one I absolutely love it's called red lights ahead wear and this is like not your typical red it's almost like a hint of coral in it it's really pretty I love this one too so excited about that one and then the next one I have I actually have in the full size and I love this polish so much so I figure like if I go traveling or something and I want like to touch up my nails or change my nail color I could just spend the mini one and this is kiss me on my tulips and this is like the perfect pink color I love it it's like kind of like a mag not magenta pink. Yeah, a little bit like a magenta pink, but more bold, like more like a hot pink magenta. Yeah, that's so gorgeous. I love that one. Then the last one, I also had this in a full size, but again, I really, really love the color. So I figured if I'm traveling or whatever, I could just bring the mini one. And this is Petal Faster Susie, which I love because that is my sister-in-law's name. But she spells hers differently. Um, and it's like a lavender pink color with a lot of go or silver shimmer in it. I hope you guys can see these. Um, absolutely gorgeous. And I'm going to... Um, this week I will be putting pictures of these on my blog. So if you can't see them as well with my camera, you can check that out there. So that is it for the Holland collection. And then the last one I have, oh, I love. And this comes with 10 polishes. And this is the best best of the best polishes so these are the top 10 nail polishes that opi sells and oh my gosh i've been wanting a bunch of these colors so i thought this would be perfect for to have in the minis first um set i'm going to show you they come apart in the box here the first set i'm going to show you are the really light colors that go all the way up to the reds and I love the packaging on this too. Oops. Alrighty. So the first one, I think I have this one. I'm not sure. Um, but this is Alpine Snow. And it's just like a very, very opaque um, white color, which would be perfect for um, like winter. And you can put like a really nice, pretty glitter top coat on it. Or you can use a white like this for like kind of sheer jelly nail polishes and you can make it more opaque um and this would be perfect you know this reminds me of like a white out white like you know the white out you use in school this is a kind of color that it reminds me of the next one is bubble bath and i've heard a lot of people talk about this color on youtube and i've been wanting this one for a while and it's a very it looks like it's going to be a sheer color like a pinky peach color. It kind of reminds me of Sugar Daddy from Essie, but more of a peachy tone, which is really pretty. Okay, the next one is Tickle My Francy, which is a, a I love OPI names um, for their polishes, and this is really pretty. It's kind of like a taupey milk chocolate color, and this is gonna be perfect perfect for the fall so I'm really excited for this one the next one is strawberry margarita Let's see some, oops, keep dropping that one. and it's a little bit it's more of a hot pink color is absolutely gorgeous and it's a cream which I love creams and then the last one I have here is Cajun shrimp and I remember in the summertime Miss um, Glamorazzi and um, Amor, or Amorexi, I, keep call, I always see Amorexi, Amorex, Amorex, Allison talked about this polish and I was wanting it and I couldn't find it so I was really, really excited to get this and this is like a more orangier red color and it's so pretty, I love it. 
Okay, so I have four more polishes and then I'll be done. Okay, and this is, this set is more of the darker colors, dark red to like almost black. And here they are here. Um, so the first one I have here is Big Apple Red. And this is just like a classic red color here. And I've been looking for a nice red color. And this is the perfect, the, this is exactly the red I was looking for. The next one is I'm Not Really a Waitress, which I don't really get the name of this, but that's okay. And it is, um, it's kind of, it's red, but it's kind of like more frosty, almost like almost burgundy color with some gold sh or silver shimmer in it. So there's that, very pretty. The next one I have been looking for everywhere, and I was so happy when I saw this in this collection. And this is You Don't Know Jacques. <laughs> I love these names. Um, and this is just like the perfect brown for the fall. It is more, it's a lot darker than the, what is this one? It's a lot darker than Tickle My Fancy. Um, but it's just like the perfect, I don't know how to, it's more darker milk dark chocolate. Okay, it's gorgeous. And then this one, oh, I'm dropping it. This one I have a full bottle in, but I love, love this color. And this is in Russian Navy. And it is absolutely stunning. It's like a navy blue color with pink iridescent glitter in it. And it is gorgeous. Just, I love it. Okay, and then the last one that I have here is Lincoln Park After Dark, and I love this color for fall and winter as well. It's a very, very, very dark purple, almost black, but when you put it next to a black color, it definitely looks purple. So, there is that, my, my little birthday haul here. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed it, and as soon as I get my iPhone, I will make a video featuring it for you guys, and I guess that's it today, and again, thank you so much to everybody who has left me such nice comments and subscribed. It really does mean the world to me. So I will see you guys later, and have a great day. Bye!